Good luck to y'all. We got some fighting chickens. To my sister's here. First day in the Philippines. Why not take her? We met these random guys. Now we're going in this nice, super nice van. We're in the. I do not know. First time to go, my bro. First time, Bobby. I can't believe there's so many people. I was literally about to leave because it's a 200 peso entry fee. I'm like, I'm not gonna pay 200 pesos to enter this. But they let us in for free when they heard we're vloggers. So here we are. What an introduction to the Philippines, bro. I don't even know what's happening. I can't believe I brought her here on the first day. What'd you think of that? <laughs> first couple hours i didn't like it either i did not like that i knew I, that was sad that was like a ritual i don't like it though they were just cheering for the chicken's death like yeah it wasn't cool but it was cool to experience it though i'm glad i did it once i'll probably never go again finally i went to fight winner he's going to win one winner oh i hope you win thank you good luck yeah, that's enough of that, bro. It's time to go explore somewhere else. Welcome to the Philippines! Woo! Come on. Frick, give me that. Oh, he cashed! Give me those! Sorry! Vlogger, welcome to my vlog now. <laughs> oh. Sister made some friends. I'm over here hooping. It's a good start of the day. So the people that invited us to that fight also told us about a fiesta all day tomorrow, 8 o'clock in the morning till midnight. And this is some of the decorations, so y'all be ready for the rest of the video. Hey! Bro, it's alive? Are you, are you, are you, are you, are you what are you doing? Are you Okay, hey, let me see Chew Poppy. So they have the same mindset with the chickens. They tried to fight their other spider and he came back. He was so sad. He's like, my spider's dead. I'm like, what do you mean you just had him 10 seconds ago? But he's like, I tried to fight him and he died. So now they're going to find more. Okay. What is that? Lizard. Lizard. Oh, bad boy. What's up, bro? Hey, what's your name? These are my first friends in the Philippines. Now they get to be my sister's first friends, bro. Such awesome kids, bro. Flying fish or sardines? My friend is sad about his spider. Hi, mom. She made it. <laughs> seaweed. 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 Roasted seaweed. Uh, are you kidding me? <laughs> It tastes like yeah. fish. Give it to her. 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 Give it to what is the point of this game? They told me this is what they're playing. I asked them, what are y'all doing? They said, we're playing. When I think of people that I want to, who I want to help with my YouTube, bro, I think about these kids that I met here and the people of the Philippines. Like, that's why. I want to keep going so hard, bro, because I want to do so much crazy things, so much good in the Philippines. So it really means a lot to me when I do this, because I, I would not do this in any other, like, I don't feel like I do this in any other country, but the Philippines, bro, like my heart and soul is here. So, and I have such big plans. Like even when I travel to all these other countries, I'm always going to come back to the Philippines and this is going to be my base, bro. The Philippines is, is it, bro. I love the Philippines. Just took her to her first mango steam. We got coffee for under a dollar. We're about to go to the parade right now. Better than Starbucks, she said, for under a dollar. It's crazy. You gotta come to Asia, the Philippines. SWAT team, you got everybody out here at the fiesta. Ants, whatever this is, so much stuff, bro. We turned the corner and they're still just endless. Dang, a huge ant. Look at that! Bro. So everybody just waits for the parade here, I guess. They're just hanging out, dude. Just I guess the drinking hasn't started. It is 
11 o'clock. 11 o'clock. The parade doesn't start until 2. Our barbecue and seafood. Here, he's going to help you out. He's going to go to try his lechon. First ever time. How about you, sir? I've had you it what? before. I will try, though. I'll try okay. it. But it's not my first time. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> the crunchy is that skin. It's three hours before the fiesta. We talked to the people here and they said that it's going to be this whole stadium's going to be full of people, bro, like a football game just to watch the fiesta, bro. That's exciting. They have so many police and everything you can imagine out here. The fire team. It's such amazing here. All these people getting ready to party. Bro. She has the snacks, Bubby. We just got mango steam, mango, lychee. Um, oranges for dragon. 170 dragon. she had dragon fruit she had everything for so cheap bro we were paying triple price on Chargao Island Coca-Cola milk hello hola hello my friend my friend hello been ready for the party it starts in 10 minutes the guapa guapa guapas I don't know what none of this stands for, but here we are, bro. We're about to witness our first ever Philippine parade. Y'all are crazy! So what's up, everybody? What's up, my vlog? So happy party today. Oh, shit! Hello! Hello! Is that real? Yes! Very real? Oh! What the heck? You got two of them. God bless y'all. Goodness gracious. We got another dollar drink, and now we got a live performance. This is awesome, bro. I love this country. Cheers. You love it? Happy vibes, always. always. <laughs> happy, happy, happy. And I know just where I go. Making the troubles in the throwing water away. This I'm better done I'm coming home to stay. Look at the line now, bro. This is so many people. I've never seen this many Filipino people, bro. This is like tens of this is hundreds of thousands, probably. At least tens of thousands. We're just right here. This is the line for the people to get in the arena, like to do all the whatever. It's like a fiesta. I don't really know what this is. I'm just here experiencing it. But I know there's a parade that ends in that arena we were in earlier. And another thing is every single one of these Filipino people are looking at us right now. <laughs> every single one of them. I love it. I love it. It is like different, a different feeling, but... Like, I don't like being center of attention, no, but it's, it's okay. Everywhere. It's everywhere. It's every single person, no, huh? and every time I look at somebody, they're already looking at me. Yeah, smiling. everybody's looking at us, but it's okay, though, bro. I love these people. I, you know, I was just telling her, they're so nice and polite. For, like, they're still making jokes at us. They're still calling me Papa Jesus. They're, everyone's saying that we're a couple, and she's so beautiful. But not one time has a person said no. anything disrespectful. Always nice. Always nice, nice and genuine nice happy positive like this country is i love your country it's the best country in the world dang like bro nobody i go on the live stream people in my community i had to hide like 20 people today because they said something like semi or, or disrespectful towards my sister we come here from the tens of thousands of people and not one person like this country is the best country ever bro i love your country bro i love your country <laughs> welcome to my vlog Y'all look awesome, bro. This is amazing. It would be the day that our last day that all this happens. It's like a parade for us leaving. <laughs> Been here for three months and now they throw a party for me. Y'all shouldn't, Philippines. Y'all shouldn't have. Here we go. The moment we've been waiting on all day. Proud, bro. That in Philippines means to be proud of the moments. Just enjoy the moment, bro. This is so awesome. But that's so enjoy weird. My best friend back at home just kept telling me that every day before I left, leading up to the day. He just kept 
be, be in the moment, be happy. And then look, Jen! my two Hooray. days, my two days in the Philippines, this is what we're celebrating. That's so weird. Bro, another day in the Philippines, the last day, bro. I'm so excited for what's next, but I'm so excited. It's a bittersweet, so I'm so excited to come back. The moment when I'm back in this country, bro, I'm gonna, it's gonna be a great day. Just wait till you come back. So oh much gosh, I will there. be back, absolutely. All right, we just got an empanada from the empanada man. You, want, you ready? Here. The bread is really good. I can't really taste the middle. I've had better. <laughs> I like the bread though. The bread has got a water. I told her that the fact that the empanada man's out here in the rain selling them for 40 cents or cheaper makes that the best empanada I've ever ate in my life. Got the wigs on, bro. It's raining now, buddy. It's raining. Go, go, go. Gana so solo, masigana sa solo. All right, so they just told us it's 51 little like cities in Cebu City or whatever you want to call it. There's 51 like towns in Cebu City, right? Each one, each town has their own different section. This is section number four. This is number four out of 51 different. And they're all competing. They're competing for like a cash prize in a cup. That's what this is. Number four. They do the Thanksgiving. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We got the eggs. We found some fresh coconut milk. It's so yummy. Gotta stay hydrated out here in these streets. This rain is poisonous rain though. I feel it, bro. It's from the city. I don't like it. It's not that healthy rain. Where are you going? Hey, we're going with y'all. Uh, here we go. Y'all ready? <laughs> Almost to meet Kobe to buy him some new shoes, bro. The last ones he has has holes in them. We're back, bro. What up, Kobe? Say what up to the vlog, man. Yeah, He's so shy, bro. He's so shy. He's shy, bro. <laughs> bro, he made varsity. His shoes got holes in them, so we're here. Bro. <laughs> it's like he's fried, bro. Damn, these Devin Booker ones look crazy. Those are the last ones you had? No. Same one? Well, bro, he made it to a private school. The only way he could go to the school is if he made the basketball team and got on scholarship. And he did it, bro. His first games this month, starting point guard for 16 under, and he's 15. So we got to get him right with some. Uh, now he's got practice shoes. He needs some game shoes. They're nice. What are these? Adidas. That's what he wanted. That's Anthony Edward. Oh, I've never seen this shoe. Anthony Edwards. Let's go. <laughs> you got your. He wanted the other ones, but they didn't have a size, so he still got Adidas. Anthony Edwards, bro. Let's go, bro. Let's go. <laughs> bro, he's so shy, bro, but he's so happy, bro. He's so happy. Trust. <laughs> What'd you say? You said. Yeah, I'm so shy, brother. There's actually a police officer in Las Vegas named Stephen Davis that always joins the lives and he said he was gonna cover he wanted to buy some kid some basketball shoes and what better yet than this kid bro it's got a hell of a story bro I can't wait till he gets older and we get to talk to him. he'll be less shy when he's older bro and uh he'll be able to tell we'll go watch him play I want to see him get better at basketball over the years what's up bro what's up? that was the end of the Philippines I hope y'all enjoyed we did everything we planned we got Kobe new shoes Marissa's here what do you think you love it I love it sad i was only here for two days but i'll be back we'll, we'll be back bro she is in love with the philippines just like i am man she only got to see the city too she didn't get to see the crystal clear waters and just paddle around that ocean it's just insane it's i'm compared to american oceans this ocean is totally a million times better you can't compare the two it's like oh it's like swimming in a crystal clear river versus swimming in a mucky swamp <laughs> it's two totally different things um but big things are coming man we're going to indonesia and we're about to take off to the moon we're still loading up 
All aboard the train to success and happiness, peace, joy. We're going to do everything we've ever talked about, man, just one day at a time. One, just try to get better. Try to better yourself every day and put yourself in position. So one day when your opportunity comes, you're ready for it. So just every single day, you got to keep grinding and keep putting yourself in that position. But I am definitely feel ready for what's next now. I'm ready to go to all these new countries. I'm ready to step out of my comfort zone and leave paradise here in the Philippines and Thailand, man. The first two countries that opened my eyes, and now it's time for more. And I had that plan. When I was super scared to go to Thailand, I knew, like, if I can just do this country first, and then it'll lead to more countries. Even though I don't have no plans right now, I know it'll lead to more. I won't be as scared. And that's exactly what happened. So I definitely recommend Thailand first and then Philippines. And then we'll see if Nepal or Indonesia is worth it. We'll see. I didn't. Uh, we will see. We will see. I don't know nothing about either of the two. And I'm just going to find out with y'all. Tomorrow's day one. We wake up. We take a plane overnight and we wake up there. It's going to be huge, man. We're going to vlog every day. We're going to go live stream a lot around nighttime for you. So right before you go to bed, check C4 on live. It might be like 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock your time. Maybe 12, 1 o'clock you might see us already on a live. Like, yeah, I'm going to try to make it consistent. I've been doing it consistent that time every day. I think Bali's on the same time zone as the Philippines. But wish my sister good luck in her travels and we're linking up with Karen, Canada, Riley. The whole squad is about to be back, bro. It's about to be sick. No crazy, negative, or disrespectful comments about sis, or you will get banned from the channel. We already had to ban like 20 different people, or maybe more during today. I'm talking about permaban, like hide you from the channel during today's live stream. So don't do that. Just have some respect, right? I don't care what you say about me, but come on. I don't even want to read nothing like crazy about her. So. Shout out to Van Boys team, man. It's only getting better and bigger, and we're reaching our goals one day at a time. And we just got to keep grinding, man. It's been nine months straight, damn near 10 months probably. So it's time that I got to just keep my head down until I come up and grind this out, man. Bali next. Hope y'all are ready as I am. It's going to be huge, bro. We're going to do it. Oh, we're going to do it. We're going to go to all the spots. Y'all tell us some spots to go to. She already has so many. We're going to we're gonna do it. We're going to better. We're going to grow closer me and her and all the whole squad is going to get closer and we're all going to grow our pages we're going to just be a team man help each other out get better ourselves in our personal life and reach get closer and closer to our dreams man until we reach them we've made it this far we just got to finish it out we just got to keep grinding bro i love y'all thank you for believing and supporting me i couldn't do this without y'all and uh, i literally love and appreciate every one of you man thank you so much god bless you bro van boys to the moon make sure i see you in the comment section and make sure you drop a like on the video it helps with the algorithm and oh we did it bro we made it to almost seventy we we're like 63 or something like that almost on instagram today we're gonna hit seventy thousand. make sure you go van boys 222 on instagram yeah, we doing it 100K on the way. And then next stop, a milli, baby, a milli. Let's go get this 100K plaque first, though, bro. I love y'all, bro. I'm out of here, bro. Another day, another vlog. Now we got a new teammate. Let's go. So editing right now. We just ordered this. Oh, my goodness. I haven't had no burger. In 30 days, I've been on that island eating fish and chicken every single meal. Oh, it's nice to have a burger. You gotta open yours up. You're probably used to it, but this is something different. And I've been eating the same stuff every day. <clears throat> it's the best thing I've ever ate. <laughs> you can't even get it open. <coughs> Have you made it this far in the video? I need to know how good this burger looks. Cheers. What'd you think? It's like good? It. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Cheers. I love y'all. On the way to the airport, how does it feel? Sad. <laughs> she got close with them girls in the neighborhood, like I am, like the little brothers, bro. I'm telling you, they're such good people and so happy. It's just so curious about our lives, and they wanna they wanna see where we're going next. 
Yeah, yeah so bro. Like they're so invested in our travels and journey because they're just, I guess, stuck here. Which, damn. I always have to come back and put a smile on their face. Our flight is about to leave. We're in the line, about to get the stamp. It's exciting. I love y'all, bro. I'll see y'all later in Bali. A new country, new adventure, new time. Let's go to the moon, baby. I love y'all. Thank you for supporting me.